Hi, in this video, we'll be looking for some basic kind of shortcuts or you can say not mostly shortcuts is just using the keys in the keyboard. Let's see how I have some shortcuts as if you see the very first one that is a delete delete is very simple. Suppose I have some text written here as uh, some name is given as here and if I want to delete it, just I'll keep my cursor at this place and use my delete key. I'll press delete same way so it is deleted if you want it back you can bring it using other shortcut control z and all so delete key is used to clear the data in your cell wherever it is next shortcut i have if i want to go vertically downwards i can use the shortcut key as page down so i'll press page down from my keyboard if you see i'm going vertically downwards if i want to come vertically upwards i can see as one screen up that is page up page up you can see i'm coming up similarly if i want to go one one cell on the right hand side i'll use my normal arrow keys like this right arrow key so I'll keep on shifting one cell on the right. If I want to come one cell on the left, I'll press left arrow key, though it is very basic. It's very useful. Next, if I want to go down, I'll use this down arrow key. If I want to come up, I'll use this up arrow key. Next is if I want to use something, let's say if I want the other shortcut is if I want to type something, right? Uh, and if I want to put a space in my keyboard, like in the cell, I'll just press space from my keyboard, put a space your cell will become in the edit mode secondly a space will be added in your cell and you can work on that so you can see space is added and it is blinking that is it in the edit mode and if you see these are the options which are not highlighted they are been grayed out right so that is space next i have if i want to go to the one cell on the right hand side i'll just press tab key one cell on the right hand side remember i had the shortcut key as right arrow key in the sense the key itself right arrow key or else if i press tab from my keyboard like this so it goes horizontally forward right if you want to come back again there's you can use this left arrow key also and you can come backward so this was tab next option i have that is a backspace suppose i i have some text as uh, let's say a tutorials point right now what i can do is if i want to come at this text and if i want to put a backspace what you can do is if once i press backspace from my keyboard the text which is written will go away and your cursor will be in the editing mode it's the opposite of the space if you if you see uh, if you see i if i this cell if i press space from my keyboard a space will be added it will be in the edit mode space and uh, you can see as backspace it work almost same next shortcut i have the enter key the last one i have the enter key suppose if i write here as something let's say tutorials point tutorials point here in the cell and once I press enter key by default your cursor will go down so if I press enter key it goes down even if you don't type and just normally press enter key it goes down but now this is a default setting what if you want uh, when you press enter it should go on the top let's say one more, one more example this is something advanced you can use it for fun purpose I'll just go to file go to options and if you go to advanced and if you see the first one after pressing enter move the selection direction by default is given as down there are four directions you can select from here suppose i want when i press enter it should go on the top so i'll select here up and i'll click on ok so after pressing enter move selection to the up cell so it's very funny but it is not usually used if i press enter from my keyboard you see it's going up right it's going up actually it should go down so if you want to change the settings again you have to go to file options and then you have to go to this advanced select this from here as down and you can click on ok so these are some basic keys which are available in your keyboard and you can use it for day-to-day -day life purpose and much more into importance itself so i hope uh, you have understood all the shortcuts here that's all for this video